what is going on everyone nick here and welcome back to knack crater county last time we uh we experimented with some some higher density as we can see growing through there where it's real loud um and you know the problems arose from that um but i think i think we have a good idea of of kind of what's going on and we should be should be okay right um i do i've been looking around i've been looking around at this map for the last you know, 10 minutes or so and uh, trying to think what I want to do because we're running out of space over here we had this little area here and that's about it that's about it um, we have some space over here but it's not the most hospitable land um, so you know putting some stuff in there eventually will be a thing um, still eventually getting a, a small lumber company over here is, is probably going to be ideal um, but we don't have the industrial demand right now so what I actually want to do is I want to finish filling this out and then we're going to look to expand. Now, I've, I've thought about over here, but the problem with going over here is I actually need to buy about four tiles. Because I need access to the highway down here to break off and come up this way. And then we would connect it back up here. So, it, it's trickier than it looks. And it, it's, it's something where... I don't just want to make a bunch of bridges across. I mean, I guess I could. I could do that, but then you have the farm on a main road, and I don't love that. We could do a, a bridge here, but um, I don't. I don't want it to be just a bunch of bridges over the lake necessarily. But we might have to do that. Um, the other option is to come over here and and fill this area in um, with potentially like some high density right on the water. But um, but but we'll see. First off, though, we, we want to take care of this. And something I thought about is we don't have the population or the university need for a full campus area. So I'm actually just going to take this university, like the base university, and we're gonna we're gonna plop it in right here. Now the reason I'm doing that is because this entire side of the city is under schools out policy so they're not even looking really to go to university so having the small one here kind of makes it feel like almost like oh this is like the community college right or the the smaller state college that's you know not the massive campus i do want a massive campus at some point but i think for now we don't have the the population to to really support that so we're gonna do that and we're gonna go ahead and build a little bit around it now what I'd like is to just have a little kind of commercial corridor right next to it. Just so that, oops, what am I, what am I doing? What am I doing? Doing that. <laughs> just so that um, if, you're, if you're going to the university, you can walk across the street and you'll have some shops you can go to, right? And the rest of this can go ahead and we're going to make a high density one here that's going to be kind of our dorm actually we might i have an idea we're actually going to make this a little bit of a nicer area we're going to have some amenities that we don't have in most of the areas such as a um that one was a community pool and then i think the sports hall and gymnasium would actually be a nice addition here once we had the money. So let's let this run for a bit. And we're going to make that. Let me make sure the. Uh, okay. Yeah. It's dezoned. Okay. Cool. And we'll go ahead and do. Let's see. How do I want to do this? Let's make this little area with the rocks. High density. Just because this could act as the dorms for the college. I don't know if you can even get one tile high density, but we'll see what happens. All right, we'll leave that at that and see what see what pops up. Hopefully the rocks don't get taken away because I like them as like a scenic piece. But uh, but we'll see. So we're gonna let that run. Ooh, these guys don't have water. Be good to give them. Go like that. Let's turn off our guides. want this going up so that it just makes sense 
A lot of stuff is leveling up, which is always good. There we go. And we have a, a few spaces that are not necessarily taken care of. So we're going to do that, and then we'll do that, and everything's taken care of. Oh, and I guess we need... I probably won't do this. Let's go here. There we go. All right, now some yeah some buildings are starting to populate. Oh, there is high density smaller buildings. So that, that I feel like that makes sense for the area, um, where it's like yeah, there's a university here, there's this community pool, there'll eventually be a big sports hall, and uh, and I think all that should be should be a okay. Now as far as the the citizens are sick because of sound, there's just not a whole lot I can do with that. Um, I mean, it, I don't know what the buildings... Let me see... Let me check out... Let me see our policies. Policies, please. Policies. Game. <laughs> Do I need it, like... What's happening? <laughs> what is actually happening? If I go over here... No, why... Do I have something on that I shouldn't have on? What is... What is happening? <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna restart this game. Alrighty, so I've reloaded multiple times. We still have no policies tab. Um, I, it even, I saw things saying, oh, turn off city vitals. So I turned off city vitals. And, uh... Yeah, none of that worked. So, we're just going to rock with no policy for this episode. And, uh, and hope that we can fix it soon. The amount of sick is annoying, especially because there's a hospital, like, right here somewhere. Yeah, it's literally right there. Um, let's get a sports hall and gymnasium, though. That, it's very annoying that that is what happened. Like, we just don't have the ability to make policies right now. Um, but, you know, not the end of the world. Gonna put the sports hall right there. This area is gonna be so stoked. <laughs> it's gonna get upgraded like crazy. Now, as far as the noise problem goes, what we could do, as I'm looking at this, is we could make this a, um, an office corridor, since we have the university right here. Um, which might just have to be kind of what we do. Cause I'm tired of having all the six citizens over here, and this is this area is gonna level up very quickly. So if we end up with a bunch of six citizens due to sound, it's gonna be a problem. But um, we'll leave it for now. In this area, though, I'm partly thinking of making this a denser populated area. I kind of want to do that, actually. Let's do the... Actually, I don't want this one. I want to leave that available. And actually, let's throw down some parks before we do anything. Let's go... I feel like... A Japanese garden makes some sense. Or a tropical garden. That could be cooler. Let's do that. There we go. So we got a tropical garden there. Let's make this a bit of a densely populated area. And actually, I guess if we're gonna do that, yeah. If we're gonna make this a densely populated area, I wanna go through and upgrade the roads now. Because we'll end up with the issue of the traffic being way too heavy. For what's actually going on. And we'll just see how this ends up going. Hopefully it works out. You know. Well. But uh, it's not necessarily a guarantee. Space already occupied. Oh I hate when that happens. Alright. Alright. 
No, what do you mean? The space? Oh my god. It's because there's like a tiny little strip right there. There we go. <laughs> we got it figured out, damn it. Okay, and just upgrade all of this so that people can easily get in and out. And I'm just going to upgrade this back road as well so that this densely populated area has actual, you know, people at it and stuff. <laughs> at least, at least that's the hope. All right, so we got that. Um, let's go through. We already have the fire department, the police headquarters, and the hospital here. The one thing I do want to add at some point is this one, the mel the the helicopter. Oh my god, the medical helicopter. I guess it could, yeah, the helicopter, whatever. Um, but we will add this eventually, um, but not not quite yet. Um, and then as for anything else, I mean, we could eventually do the uh, kitty. What are you doing? Let's see, where is this one here? We could eventually make the down here area, like this little like triangle, have a bunch of cool boat stuff. But for now, for now we're okay. So let's see, let's continue zoning. Um, ideally I don't want too much going on this road up here. We'll go like that, we'll have uh, yeah, we'll have this be housing. And we just want to make it so that they don't take out the rocks. But they've been good about it over here, so I'm not going to worry too much. We'll do that. And I think we'll go little commercial corridor here. Little commercial corridor here. And the rest of this can be high-density living. And then, yeah, we could do over here. Why not? We might have to tear this down at some point, but that should be fine. There you go. That's good. Okay. We'll leave that. That should take care of a majority of our... Um, of our... What do you call it? Residential demand. So we should be looking pretty good there. Got a bunch of these little things popping up over here. Um, yeah, like I said, we do, yeah, we are getting that noise sickness, which is super annoying. Let's see. I do, I, I am going to dezone. We're going to dezone that entire area and make it offices. And on this side, I'm going to dezone it and we're going to do low density um, commercial. Because we do have some commercial demand. So if we can make that all it not work. Get out of here. There we go. And that'll just push more people into using the area over here, which should be fine. How's our electricity? Our electricity is super good. So that's great. We have some abandoned buildings. We are also getting that same issue over here, which is not super ideal. We also have trash issue, which that should be taken care of it does give a little bit of pollution but I actually don't hate the idea of having one of these up here somewhere um, let's go let's see where do I want to put this because we definitely need one of these up here I think um, let's go I mean, we could just have it in this corner. I just don't want it to be a situation where this ends up taking up a bunch of the road, but it looks like it's fine. We're going to put a recycling center there so that it can access the city over here. And then we'll probably have to eventually buy a tile out here and have another recycling center maybe on the other side over here. But we'll see. We'll see what happens because this the, the high density area over here is going to generate quite a bit of trash. I do like it though. There's something cool about the high density in like a wooded area. I'm into it. I'm into it quite a bit. Now learning wise, how big? The public library is huge. Wouldn't be the worst thing to have over here though. 
And actually, what we should be looking at... We have an elementary school over here, but we, we need one for over here. So let me place one... Right here. And then we'll need a high school eventually as well. Alright. So once we can place the high school, put that... Across from the... The school, the, the elementary school. I think. The terrain's not great, but that's okay. Yeah. There we go. It's it's a little wonky, but that's kind of what you get when you're playing on a hill. Now, that's a dangerous slope for the kids. Not gonna lie. But uh, as that fills in, that'll, that'll even itself out. So, not the end of the world. I do really like this little area. This little area is cute. I will let that go. Our commercials filling in. We have our office buildings as well now. Oh no, we don't have office buildings actually. Not too many of those have filled in. But that's okay because that's space that can be, you know, filled in eventually. Let's see, how's our our university has only 102 students. So that it'll take some time to get some students through. Yeah, we need educated workers pretty bad. Alright. That's okay though, that's what we're working with. Policy still doesn't open. <laughs> um How's this looking? About 12%. Okay. That's pretty good. That is pretty good. Oh, I didn't know this produced electricity. That's interesting. Okay. That's convenient. Oh, and our this landfill is full. Wow. This is a bit of a cluster. I wish I had... Oh, we got small city. Nice. <clears throat> so we got monorail, which is awesome. I love that. We also got a lot of the train terminals. So we got a cable car, which could be fun. Uh, we got a hydropower plant for a as a uh, a dam. Unique buildings. We don't have anything. Oh, we have quite a few of them actually. We have a panda sanctuary, a temple complex. Okay. A boat museum. We could do a winter market, but that doesn't make a ton of sense. So we're okay there. So that's going to be... So they're in use. They're, they're, you know, unfilling or un... What's the word? They're they're taking out their stuff. You, you, you know, you understand. Let's see. Loading garbage. Waste transfer facility. Um, let's see. The building pollutes less and can be built closer to the city center. Okay. Waste process. So we want that eventually, but... We're not going to have that now. So what we are running into is it is just all educated workers, it looks like. Yeah. Which is probably because we have such a large area for schools out, but we need that to support our industries. How's our how's our farm doing? Making 8,000. Yes, yeah, so our, our farm's still our big money maker. But now I think is the time we need to look at building out. So, if we build out this way, it does give us the rail line as well. Which could be huge. Which is actually probably very necessary. Let's grab this one. And I think I'm going to grab this one as well. Yeah, we're going to grab this one as well. There we go. So those are our four tiles we had to play with now. So over here, we want this rail line to come through to our city. Um, I think it's going to come down from this way. Yeah, so let's let's work on that a bit. We're going to put this down to speed one. And then let me get... Oh, I had to construct a train station first. Okay. So a cargo train terminal. This is going to help our um, the goods we have get out of here. And I want to put it kind of in the middle between these two, actually. So let me go with a small industrial road. We're going to have it come out to there.
And yes, we're going to end up having to, to take away some rock. But I think that's going to be okay for the most part. Because we need, this is more important. So let me go ahead and fix this junction real quick. Ooh, let me fix all these junctions. Let me just take a quick scope through the city. Fix some stuff up. Just to make sure we don't have any unnecessary uh, junctions. Yeah. Okay. So we got that. <clears throat> so on this road is where we're going to want our cargo train terminal. Now this does likely mean we will need to go under ground for some of this. Um, but that's okay. So we can go to there. And then I mean we could pop back up Although going under, hmm, we want to do this. Let's get us going. See, it, it feels too easy to just do it the underground the entire way, especially because that wouldn't be how a train would necessarily normally go. And it's very expensive to do an underground rail line all the way over, but it might end up being necessary. Cause I mean, we could just make it go through. Huh? Let's see. How do we want to do this? Cause we actually need it to go over cause it can't intersect with the, um, with the subway. Let's have this come out over here. And we'll have the train line end up going over our industrial area. And then I'll come up and connect. It's such a long route. All right. Let's let that go for a bit. Now, is it the most ideal thing in the world? No, but eventually it, it will be good. I promise. <laughs> Actually, I don't necessarily make that promise, but it's okay. <laughs> It'll be expensive. I mean, but I feel like we know that. Um, yeah. Okay, it should, yeah, take care of both. And it, that's going to be a, a one, it's going to be, it's just going to have to be a stop. Now, as far as having a passenger train station which is something is something we should probably look at let's see I mean we could do it it's just so noisy I think we wait on the passenger train station I think it's gonna be So we're at four percent there. It's gonna it's gonna end up being a cargo train station for now, just to kind of reduce traffic a bit, and then we'll figure out. Yeah, we'll figure stuff out as it goes. We'll see what happens. Hey, I can open policies now. <laughs> All right. So let's see. Extra insulation. Oh, that's for energy. Okay. Educational blimps. Prefer parks. Free Wi-Fi. Huh. Automated sorting. For-profit education. A book fair. Increased cost of upkeep, but public libraries become better. That could be good. I'm actually going to make this. <clears throat> I think we're going to go like this. And then we're going to make a new district for this. 
Because this is such a big area. That I think um, we want this to be. Let's see, education boost. Yeah, let's go education boost for this area. And we're going to do um, book fair. This will be this will be a high um, education zone. Like we're, we're focusing on education there. All right. And for our train station, we're going to have that come through. We're going to have it gradually. Let's see. Is there a way to get this? We might actually need to take it to the right. Oops. So can we take it across this way? No. Oh. All right. Let's see. How are we going to do this? So... Could we go up one more and it'd be fine? Wait a minute. Oh my god. I mean, we could we could destroy some buildings over here. This is such a wild idea for a train. It also looks hideous and we're not going to do that. <laughs> That's such a wild thing to have a train try to do. All right. I think what we end up doing... Let me go back slightly as I accidentally destroy a bunch of trees. Let me have it... We're gonna loop this way. And we're just gonna have it... There we go. That works. That way makes so much more sense. We'll take it under the freeway. Like so. Pop it back out. Over here. And yes, it's going through like a mountainous area. But that's A-OK. -okay. Oh, probably should have. Where's that train line? It's up there. Okay. And we're just going to have it go. What? Oh. Right there. All right. We have a connected train line. <laughs> Is it the most hideous thing in the world? Yes. But as long as it works, we're okay. Um... Yeah. As long as it works, we're fine. That's going to be our cargo. Our cargo train area. We have train connection, damn it. Um, yeah, we're, we're good. Now, as far as an airport goes, we just had the blimp depot. Yeah. And we can't do an airport area yet. Because we have to have the terminal first. Which is... Oh no, that's just airport. I wonder how this... I don't know. For that, What is this? Oh, this is the cable. Okay. We will actually do a cable eventually. I think having a cable car that goes across the wa the lake would be kind of cool. Um, but we'll figure... We'll get to that when we get there. Alright, let's see. What are, we, what are we looking at? We need... Educated workers. So that's becoming much more of a problem than it uh, originally... Felt like it was going to be. Now, in this area over here, we don't have that much traffic. I do want a bus line that goes through here. Um, I do think that'll be important. We don't have a bus line going through here either. So let me go ahead. Right outside of this, um, this area here. 
We want to make sure it stops in a lot of the important locations. So the university. Have one stop up here. Right here. Here. And then where's our schools? Our schools are... Oh, they're right here. Okay, cool. So the stop, that's perfect for the schools. We'll stop right here. We'll stop again here. Then we'll connect there. And then that line, this is going to be a darker blue. And this is going to be um, community college way or line. There we go. And then up here, we want to do another one where once again, we'll have it by the metro. And we'll have it just go through this entire little area. Right there, right there. And we just want this to be nice and easy. And to kind of connect as you go. Now, why is there a stop over here? Just in case you want to get off there and walk to work. I think that would make sense. And let me adjust that one. This one can be gray. <clears throat> and this is going to be ore line. There we go. Now we have buses going through our city. Should hopefully have some more transit going through there. And it should that should work out pretty well for us. I know we have a bunch of new buildings. Get out of here with that. Alright, our, our farm is just killing it constantly. So... I'm happy with that. We have our two flour mills, our bakery. Uh, we might be able to get some more production out of this, to be honest. I'm going to bump it to 150 and see if we can fulfill that. Because we have so much of everything coming out of here. Now, do we have... Do we actually have trains being used? Is my question. I don't see... I'd like to be able to see some train happening. Whoops. Is there... Oh, 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 we got trains, boys. Let's go. Let's go, cargo trains. <laughs> That's huge. I love that. All right, cool. So now it should be even more efficient to get our stuff out, and that should release the burden of traffic slightly. Um... And that's awesome. <laughs> that's super awesome. All right. Now for our next little endeavor. We do have very high residential demand. And I would like to have this area up here be a new residential zone. I think I'm going to make the area over here the, a big university eventually. Uh, but this is going to be our high de another big high density area. So I'm going to pause this. And I'm actually going to put one of these bad boys in, I think. Let's see. I actually, I don't know if that one makes as much sense as this one. But then the problem is get it, uh, having access to this side over here. I mean, we could... Hmm... Because we could use the area up here as well. And that actually might be smart. So making this a clover leaf. And then having a change over here to access this area. Let's see, I think I am going to do that. Alright, so let's go ahead. We have a lot of money, so I can do this. Alright, let's we're gonna delete all this stuff. We're going to make this a clover leaf. Okay, so we got to delete a bit more. We're going to go. We want it to be even with that. Yeah. And then let's grab... What highway road did they use? Is it just this one? 
No, it was definitely not that one. Um, it's this this one. No, it's not. That's a four. Where's the three lane? Is it just highway? Yeah. Okay. And let's we're gonna make these connect a bit better over here. I'll have it slope in a bit. And we can kind of adjust that with uh with move it. There we go. I don't why is this not connected? Oh were those oh I put one ways, I'm stupid. Or I mean yeah, it's one way, but um it just needs to be flipped. There we go. Now we're good. Okay, so that's taken care of. Now up here... Those ones just connect nice and smooth. And the ones over here are going to be a little bit uglier. Mmm, that looks like it's going to be ugly. How are we looking here? That's a bit of a hard turn. Let's go ahead and we're gonna rock move it for that one. There we go. Okay. Look at that. You'd never know I cheated. <laughs> um, but that's what we're gonna do, and th that'll give us access to over here eventually. Um, but for now, we're just gonna do this to close it off. Um, let me let that be the right direction. There we go. And now over here. I think we do just want, well, let's see. How do we want to do this? Cause I'm looking at what we got and I'm thinking, I'm thinking a, a, a person train station could be over here, kind of out of the way. Um, and so how do we want to do this? Let's see. I mean, because we could, we could do this and then build off of it eventually. And have it go throughout the, the city. Um, yeah, that's fine. We're going to, we're going to do that. Is that going to be enough space? No. Is that enough space? No. <laughs> it's such a big piece. Will it connect? It does connect properly there. Okay, cool. And let's go ahead. Just reconnect that. And then this is going to be our kind of downtown type area. And what we'll do, I go like this, and then this is going to branch, actually we might make this a six, let's make it a six, like so, and then branching off of that is going to be I have a good under right there. Branching off of that, like so, is going to be a whole area that's going to be all just like stuffed residential. This entire area will be like very densely packed residential. Now, <clears throat> what I want to do with this little area. Is I actually, I think I might make this a, an amusement park. But I could be, I could be bullshitting. <laughs> I haven't quite decided yet. We're going to let this just follow the topography of the area. Like that. And we'll have it go 
and follow up to here. And then we're going to use that to do our normal roads going throughout. But first, we want to make sure we uh, properly connect these. Let's first do that so that they stay relatively straight. There we go. Delete that. And there we go. That's on off onto the... The six lane, it transitions into a four lane, and then that four lane is just going to be gridded out from there. Let's see, actually, I am going to start there. Let's go up there, and we're just going to grid. Game, please. Space? What do you mean space? The space is not already occupied. Get out of here. All right. It's being it's being a butt. So we'll make it. We'll we'll do it the way it wants. I don't want to do that though. <laughs> and we'll follow. And we'll follow this and grid it out. Because again, the goal of this is gonna be. That's a very close intersection. I feel like. Hmm. Hmm. I have an idea. Take that away, and we do what I originally did, and go like that. <laughs> so it'll be every two... We want this to come down and connect. This will still go up. How'd that go? And this is just going to be followed through like so. We're going to have this go up. And you might be like, Nick, this is hideous. And you're right. You're absolutely right. But <laughs> it's what it's what we're doing. Okay. Um, and actually, instead of having that like that, let's see, is there a decent way? That is kind of the only way. Let's go ahead and let's see, how do we want to do this? I think that's... I think this is basically going to be fine. We'll go like that. It's not pretty, but it's going to work. And we're going to let this continue through. And we're going to do... Actually, I don't... We don't need that, I don't think. It's needed kind of up here, but that's... Not necessarily the end of the world. Actually, I have an idea for what I want over here. We're going to do our theme park up here. It's going to be this area here. And so if you want to go to the theme park, you can. And we'll just, we'll, we'll fill this out with stuff. And we'll also make a connecting line here. And a connecting line here. There we go. And that's all just going to be gridded. We're good. Let's get water going through here. They come right on up. Again, it's not the prettiest thing in the world, but once we get this filled in, it'll start to look good. So, now we're just going to take this straight on up and down. Go across and go across. There we go. And then, yeah, this area will connect like so. There we go. Power will be a problem, but we'll we'll deal with that eventually. All right, <laughs> let's make a paint a park area. It is going to be this area over here, like so. Okay, and that is going to end up being a amusement park. 
we'll have a nice big old main gate right there. Okay. We're gonna we're get, we're getting our stuff. We want a side gate as well. That we're gonna place. What? Oh, that's a small. We're gonna place a side gate right on over here. And then do these rides have noise pollution? They don't really. Do really none of them have noise pollution? Because that's actually incredible. There's no way. There's no way. None of them have noise pollution. So we could put houses right up against this. That's hilarious. All right. I mean, if it's going to let us do that, that's fine. I'm not necessarily going to complain. Um, but we're going to rock that. We're going to let this go down to uh, speed one. Let's get some power running over to here. And I think we're just going to take it from here and at least for now it's going to be ugly but we're going to have to do it until stuff um you know connects and works so we'll do that let's get this park underway um let's connect here turn my guides on Actually, let's just go right there, and then we'll have a straight shot there. And we really want to plan kind of what we want out of this, right? So we want a plaza. Probably right when you walk in, because that's how most theme parks have it. We also need a souvenir shop. And some restrooms right as you come in. And we're going to put another restroom over by the side gate. And we'll probably put a souvenir shop on this side too. Like so. <sighs> the amusement park cafe. Let's see where we want this. We could put it, we could put it kind of at this little, this little intersection. And then across from that can be some game booths. That one right there. That one right there. Now we got a cute little area you can come to here. And then I like it when the carousels like right when you walk in. There's something like thematically nice looking about that. So we'll slap that right there. In order to level up, we need to have visitors. So that's going to be a while. So we'll leave that as is. Now. As for the area over here, we definitely want all of our little amenities, so we're going to do that. Just right on over here. What the, the police station over there? Alright. Then, we're going to rock... And we should probably wait. We're, we're going we're gonna to let that go. We're going to wait till we get some money. Because we want to place our schools and some of the other stuff before we um, before we go to Buckwild. Place that school right there. We'll do a small children's park. Right behind that. Or we could go across the street from it. Or right here. That looks better. Okay. And then we just want a high school and we'll be good. So once we hit 24,000, this has been a weird episode. I've done a little bit of everything, but I think expanding is going to be important. We still have, what are these guys complaining? Oh, they're, because they're still, yeah, they're still high density. Okay. That's okay. We're about to have a whole new developed area over here. Once we get the appropriate things placed. Let's go ahead. We'll put this one. Right like that. And then we have all of our basics covered, I think. So we're going to zone that whole area. This entire strip is going to be high density commercial. Ooh, not like that. Just 
just like that. The the park area, we're going to end up fencing that off. So that's not going to be a uh, a thing that's that's necessary. Go ahead and start filling in some of these houses a little bit. There we go. They're all getting Now the sound shouldn't be as bad here because it's only one layer of high density commercial. So it should be okay. But we'll let that fill out. That'll that'll pick up quite a bit of stuff. And from there, then we can continue to work on our amusement park. Now the amusement park fencing, I want to put this in. And we just want this to really go all the way down this. We don't want people just to be able to walk into our amusement park. They, I mean, they won't. The game's actually quite good about not letting them. But just for, like, aesthetic reason, it would be nice to do this. I want to take this all the way up. And let's see, how far do we want this going out? We'll go here. Yeah, that works. And we'll just continue it. Kind of fall on the freeway. And then eventually... Cutting back. Fall on the road. There we go. Alright, our entire area is fenced in nicely. We can work with that. Now, I immediately see... What I want to do here. We want to take this and come through like so and let's get some stuff over here um we don't really have anything unlocked right now and i don't like putting a ton of stuff in an area in which um oh we have no sewage wait we have no sewage We're definitely connected are we just yeah we, we just need sewer treatment whoops we do have this huge tank reservoir. Um, let's see. Oh, that's not... That won't help us at all. I'm tripping. Let's go ahead and we got to do another eco treatment plant. We're going to put one up here. We'll smack it... Uh, yeah, we'll put it next to the incineration plant. Why not? And then we'll go ahead and connect that. There we go. Now we let that run for a second and we're good. Okay, cool. So it shouldn't be an issue for these guys, thankfully. Uh, the one thing I do worry about this area is... Um, trash. Oh, and this intersection. Let's, let's go ahead and fix that real quick. We're going to go like this all the way through. Um, that one can have that. Okay. Should make things go a bit smoother. There we go. And they'll all come off and go to their houses. Have a good time. Woop woop. <laughs> now what I will do is we will put some office buildings. I think right along this. Just kind of have a little bit of a barrier from the, the freeway. And then what I'd like to do... Is because we've now extended this area, I do want a metro over here. Now, ideally... It does... It causes so much noise, huh? Yeah. We want to place this... Somewhere that's not going to be too, too bad. Let's see. We can't place it inside the amusement park. We're going to have to place it right here. And we're, we're going to want to connect that to our main line, which is way over there. <laughs> um, and actually, I guess what we should do is build. See, it's hard to have a metro in the main area. I don't think we are going to end up doing that. I, I was going to put one in the center over here, but I don't think that's a smart idea. 
So what we're going to do instead is we're going to connect this going out this way. I just want it to connect to right there. And then this side over here. Um, we are going to place a metro over here. That's going to be connected to if we had money. <laughs> because we are going to develop this area here. Um, once we have some more demand, we will develop this area. And actually, what I think I'm going to do right now is develop the strip. So that it can, so we can kind of take care of some of that commercial demand that we have. How's our how's our park looking? We're getting there. Not a ton of visitors, but I understand because it's just a carousel, a cafe, and some games. <laughs> um, but eventually we'll have more to it. Yeah, I like I like our metro being right there. That that works for me. You guys should have power pretty soon. We just need one thing to pop up right here and we're good. Yep, there we go. And because of that, we can pause it. And we're going to delete here. And get rid of all this line. And then just plop down some line somewhere. Will that is that a close enough connection? No, that's so annoying. Uh, let's go. I want to do this. I mean, I guess we're gonna have to do that. Whoops, sorry, building. <laughs> Did not mean to do that. And now nothing over here is gonna have power for a minute until that gets filled. Please, please. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Bit of a mess. Bit of a mess, but that's okay. So we have our commercial demand getting taken care of. And actually, we could do commercial demand over here on the other side. Um, if we feel like we need to. But I like that we have like a big kind of bustling city over here. Stuff's going okay over here. Our, uh... Our facility over here isn't doing too great. We need more workers. But that's just because we've had so much population need. Um, and that's okay. We are looking for educated workers still. How is our university doing? 287 total. We did get to big city. We got a liberal arts college campus area. Um, we can make a crematorium finally, which is awesome. And we got some of the, the other stuff. Okay. So we do want to place some crematoriums real quick. Now what is that? There's no pollution, no noise pollution or anything like that. So let's go ahead. We want to place one over here. Just so that we can have some of this stuff. Let's see. I'll place it right there. Place another one just right in here. Again, like a little morbid, but it's fine. We'll have a, a crematorium up here. There we go. Now we just have a, a decent amount of death care. So we shouldn't have to worry about that too much. This area is getting there. We'll have enough visitors soon enough. Yeah, soon enough. Our trains are rocking. Which is which is is nice. We could have another highway connection over here, but I don't think it's particularly necessary. Um, just cause. I am thinking of making the lake a nature park, and maybe having hiking trails that'll go out to here. But uh, but we'll see. We'll see what's going on. I kind of like the little wedge amusement park we got out here, next to this nice high density area. Now, our industry area, this is a little bit of an issue. Um, as far as our districts go, King Square 
It does have the schools out policy. This district doesn't have that policy at all. And then Hemlock Square is more of a... More of an education area. And I think that's, I think that's fine. Um, we do need probably some buses throughout here. Or even just a... Bus line that'll take you... Oh, these aren't connected. I forgot we didn't connect these. Whoops. Almost went through this whole thing. Oh, we're getting out of... Uh, we're almost out of electricity. Luckily, we have all of this. And we'll just place a couple. Because why not? There we go. We had the money. So that should keep us okay for a while. And now... I'll just go ahead and connect up there. And then we will connect this. When we have money. <laughs> but we do want a rail line going out to that direction. Because that'll, that'll give us way more visitors to the amusement park. At least that's, that's the plan, you know. So we need... Roughly about 35,000. Trying to think of a better way to connect this. Because we, we don't want it coming off super sharp. So let's go. That's such a hard turn. What if we just came straight onto it? So 20,000 is what we're looking for. Let's speed this up. And we'll see what happens. Now, our garbage. So we have the incineration plant working. Let me just check. Our garbage processing is not great. Um, another incineration plant could be good. We could just go ahead and let this start being filled again. We'll go like that, we'll continue emptying here, and we'll just kind of flip them back and forth, honestly. Um, at least for now. Alright, we need, we're looking for 20,000. I just want to get this connected so it becomes part of the network. Because I think that'll be... Helpful. So if we do that, there we go. And now what we can do is let's go here and let's do our lines. What is this? No, wait. Create a new line. There we go. And go up to there. And go up to there. It's going to go up to there. And then from there, we're going to keep it Eh, we can have it go all, going all the way around. That's fine. I guess there's no reason not to. So we'll go like that, and then we want... Go here. The Metro Line 3 is the one we just did. We'll let that be the uh, red line. i make the color for that one red. And then we want... So that one went this way, so we want the another one going the opposite direction. I'm going to create a new line. I'm going to come this way. And we're just going to have it go... Wait, what? What just happened? Hold on. So we came up to here. What is, what is happening? Okay, so yeah, we added the stop there. Why is the line... not actually working? Add stop. Add stop. Then it completes right there. Okay, so once it that's weird. Yeah, once it once it got placed, it was fine. Okay, whatever. 
And that one can be our... Uh, what color haven't we used? That can be our... We'll make that one the... Make it like the burgundy line. I know it's not necessarily burgundy. But whatever. There we go. Alright. Now we should have... So a decent amount of foot traffic going through here and they'll be able to come right over to the to the um, amusement park now what might be I do want a tram could be cool what is oh a trolley bus is this kind okay let's do we can't really do a tram depot right now. What about... Oh, that's Metro. That's train. Wait, what one? The trolley bus. I mean, that one could be cool to just send back and forth on this road. But it's such a big thing. It had to be up here. Yeah, so it had to be right there. And that's a lot to take up. I do just want, I guess you could walk that. It's not the most ideal thing in the world, um, but it should work. Yeah, a lot of people are going through there, which is good. That'll take you wherever you want to go. And I think that's, that's fine. All right, let's, let's, let's take a quick look at the city. See what we got. We have some trash issues. Which is not the most shocking thing in the world. <laughs> Let's go ahead. And we want to place some recycling centers. So I think... It's not a lot of pollution. So I think having some in the areas over here isn't a terrible idea let's uh why are we below ground there we go hey we got our uh, amusement park upgraded cool so let me have a little side road here and we're gonna put a recycling center on this and we're actually gonna place two just so that this whole area Gets a decent amount of, of um, recycling center stuff to it. And then let's... Let's see. Let's go ahead and just zone up to it. Yeah, we'll go a little buck wild. Why not? So we're doing that. Let's go like so. Now our water treatment is becoming small issue so let's go over here and we're just gonna end up I guess we're just gonna end up destroying that because we have to what distance too short there <laughs> why you gotta make it complicated <laughs> there we go all right Everybody, everything should work fine there. That should give us plenty of water, and we need sewage treatment. Uh, let's see. We do have the advanced inland water treatment plant. Which it does do a ton of pollution. Which is never ideal, you know. But um, we'll go ahead and place it right there. And we just gotta make it... Connect... There we go. All right, that should give us, that should cover us for a while. We have these areas. Our two recycling centers have electricity now. Beautiful. That area is forming up. And of course we have immediate sickness. Ugh. That's okay. Not the end of the world. We can always just dezone these areas because I just don't want to deal with the sickness. I don't want to get down with the sickness, please. That's okay. 
We can work with that. We'll end up putting in some stuff. But before we go today, let's go ahead and upgrade our park with some cool stuff. We have rotating teacups, which can be placed right on over here. And then let's go ahead and we have a piggy train. This is going to be kind of our kid area here. So we'll do that. We're going to put a, uh, a game hub kind of down here towards the end. Just in case, you know. You want mom and dad need a break. And they're like, all right, kids. You're going to go play some games. And we'll go ahead and place a bathroom down here. Right there. And a, uh... Ah, yeah, that should be it for now. We can, now what we can do is we can place... Like, little park areas within this. So if we wanted to, we could have... A, um, a park structure coming off of this. Where's it at? Where's the thing I'm looking for? Oh, we have all these rides, too. We could do this. Okay. So let's have right across from the... The bathroom over here. We're going to have just like a little area. Oh, can we place this? Oh, we can't place it on anything, sadly. We can have some games, though. Oh, here we go. This is what I'm looking for. Let's go ahead and we're going to line this up if we can. And we'll just... Plop it down. Want to make this a little bit prettier than it normally would be. I think that's pretty damn good, all things considered. Let's go ahead. We're going to put some... Why can we not put it in the center? I don't know. All right, whatever. We're going to have a couple little picnic tables. Actually, let's go ahead and do that. Let me move or bulldoze. <laughs> I'm gonna bulldoze that. And this is just to make it give it a little bit nicer of a feel. I'll have a little balloon cart here. And then let's have some just some little kid rides kind of next to this area. So that you know the parents can kind of hang out and chill. Have a couple little cars. Some crane games. All kind of lying in the area. And, ooh, we get Grand City. We get Solar Panel Plant, which is awesome. A baseball park. Waste Transfer Facility. Waste Processing Complex, which is huge. Inner City Bus Terminal. And a Bus Metro Hub. The Bus Metro Hub is going to be big. That's going to be awesome to get in. Um, But we'll... We'll figure that out as it goes. I want to delete that bush. There we go. Just because we want a couple of games in this area. And we'll have a cotton candy cart. Kind of right on next to here. So that you can just come in. It's, it's chill. It's relaxed. The kids have a nice little bit of an area. And uh, the parents can kind of, you know, take a load off. I just want to kind of sprinkle these in throughout. So that it feels like, you know, it's a, it's a little bit more alive. And we'll place this. Actually. Get rid of the balloons. Place that right there. Perfect. Put the balloon cart. Put the cotton candy right there. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful. Couldn't ask for couldn't ask for better. <laughs> and of course, as we unlock more and more stuff, we will make it You know, a bit more wild, a bit more fun. But for now, I think this is pretty much okay. And I am gonna actually slot in. Actually, maybe not, because we, we want to we wanna use up the area. So we'll, we'll leave this as is for now. It'll be called Wonder Park. If you guys have a better name for it, let me know. And uh, yeah, going to get out of here. Thank you all so much for watching. And hopefully, I see you next time. See ya.